Milk is known for its many benefits. The vitamins A and D are essential to the human body, and it is an excellent source of calcium, aiding in maintaining strong bones and teeth. However, in June of 2005, the FDA reported that cow's milk suddenly reached an unusually high volume of calcium. The reason behind it is still a mystery to us. The extreme level of calcium yielded some unexpected and unprecedented results. Why don't you take a look? Little Stinky Robinson was a normal young boy. He loved sweets and fried foods just like any other American kid. Until one day, Little Stinky learned about healthy eating at his public middle school. Mmm. 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 All that milkshakes. After learning this new information about nutrition, Little Stinky was determined to include milk in his everyday diet. Then, Little Stinky's life would take a dramatic turn. <clears throat> After consuming only 8 ounces of skim milk, Little Stinky Robinson grew 4 times his own size due to the high calcium levels that were suddenly found in cow's milk. As Little Stinky Robinson had become a giant, an everyday activity was now a nuisance for him. Ow! Mm. Ow, that hurt! Tired and embarrassed of his abnormal size, little Stinky Robinson turned to the one person who would be able to help. Ah uh, yes, of course, I remember little Stinky Robinson. He was a very interesting case indeed. Our treatment for him was an experimental one. Every day we gave him 4,000 gallons of dark soda via IV to deteriorate the surface of his massive bones. The phosphorus in the soda also hindered the absorption of additional calcium into the bloodstream. Over time, little Stinky Robinson slowly but surely returned to his original size as a healthy young boy. After the saga of Little Stinky Robinson's freakish growth had ended, the public became aware of his story. Mysteriously, the calcium concentration in cow's milk suddenly returned to its normal level, and another such case has since never been seen. Although experts doubt this ever happening again, scientists are still searching for an answer as to why it ever did. However, America's dairy producers have been uncooperative. Listen, honey, we provide these vitamins and minerals to help folks out. We resent your accusations. Now please, stay off the grass. Will scientists ever find the answer? Probably not. And as for little Stinky Robinson, he has fallen into a diabetic coma due to Dr. Esperanza's irresponsible medical care. That's it for tonight, folks. See you next time. You stay classy, College Park.